people, we here in Maracas and we having a blast of our time. Just some good old talk, all right? And my boy sucking a mango. They were saying, brother, what kind of mango is that? Julie mango, boy. Julie mango, yes. It's how the lifeguard pass. Blow the whistle. Yes. She tell me you're, di you're, you're, you're biting too deep. <laughs> <laughs> good one, good one, good one, good one. <laughs> so people, we just walking along the shores of Maracas Bay and we trying to see if we could meet up with some people, right? So I seen some tourists here. Let me check them out. Hey! hey. What part of the world are they from? Jamaica. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, man. <laughs> I am the Trini. Yes, yes, yes. Nice, nice. Yeah. And you, where you from? Lovable Lufan. Look like from Guyana, you know. <laughs> 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 Lovable yes. Lufan, Trinidad boy. Nice, man. <laughs> so, people, it's a nice day, and let me pan the scenery a little bit. All right? People just having a really, really great time. Right, so it's vacation time in Trinidad for kids, and it's so nice to see so many parents outside here enjoying themselves with their family. All right, niceness, niceness in the place. Wow, that's a tall coconut tree. I wouldn't want to be on any that coconut tree if a coconut fall down. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yes, so. Let me go back and check my boy Lance today. Lance, what is he doing there? Really taking a tan or something? Huh? Yeah, boy. Mm. I enjoy myself here, boy. You want to bring our next mango for you? No, 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 that's good, that's good, that's good. Let me take a little walk down. Huh? Come, come, come. We ain't going far, man. Let me take a little walk down, man. Oh, God, boy. Get up. We take our father and, and um, son stroll, man. Our father and son stroll. All right. You so, walking sideways. And let's go and show them your face a little bit, and then I'm gonna flip camera so they can take in the seats. All right? Yeah. Flip camera. <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> so we have a nice time. Hello, hello. hello. Okay. Yeah, Mr. Batis. Yeah, man. Flip the camera. I'm red like a sweet potato, man. A sweet potato. You surprised me today, you know? You ready? How come? Yeah, I, I, I never think rain falling. Yeah. And at that hour, we're going to leave to, to come on the beach here. Must be age, boy. Must be age. Age, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, after a while with age, you don't fight anything, you know? Yeah, you learn you learn not to fight things. Well, then I thought, woman, two boys, we were doing the same thing, you know? Me, you uh. fight nothing, you know? <laughs> yeah, I tell you that. That is the best way, yes? Yeah. That is the best way. People, it's a beautiful day. Indeed. Indeed. Well, as you all know, right, as I say in the last clip, Daddy do edit the videos, eh? Is run camera and then straight up to YouTube. So, all right, you can't walk too far, we'll be good turn. No, 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 go ahead, no, man. No, 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 man. No, 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 no. Yes. Like my flag at times, eh? I'm telling you, yeah. yeah. Hey, you know, I think they change our flag every month. Yeah, Think. because I was in, in Sendai Excellence. Yeah. I noticed it was a, a little torn. Right. And then I see they put up a new one. Okay, okay. And I already see that one Saturday already, so I see probably once a Monday is how to change that. Perhaps, perhaps, yeah. 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 But it's nice, you know, they're still persevering to promote. Yes, yes. Hello? The, the, the symbol. Yes. So people, everybody just having a nice time. You gotta walk closer to them waves and holding the camera extra tight. Alright? I'm taking some nice waves. Man. Hello, hello. Alright. So cool, so refreshing. What a real nice boy, Daddy. Real, real, real nice. Yes. 
Hello, did you get that ridge up there? Snow on the mountain. Really looking like some kind of misty mountain, huh? Yeah, right. Wow. Yeah, boy. Hey, this phone camera quality real good, boy. Yeah, very good. Real good, real good. Nice phone. And look at up there, like the tower up there. Yeah, boy. Alright, guys, there's some sort of cell tower. Hey, let me see how the zoom really working. You know they say the best things in life. Hey dad? Hello? The best things in life are free. Are free. What do you think That's about that boy? Very true. At God's gift boy, the free things that we can enjoy, they belong to the Lord. Hmm. Yeah. And nobody can take that from us, huh? No, 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 no. no. Nobody can take that from we us. We can lose it of ourselves. Right. You know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, but you just hold on to it, man. Hmm. Have faith. Yes. You know this? They start putting on some cones. Yes. One, two. What do you think that represent? Where the current is or yeah. do go beyond? Maybe that's to keep boats out of the bay. I want to believe so. Keep boats out of the bay. Right, so we notice in these yellow um buoys. Shaped like um a cone shape. And we want to believe we want to believe is to to keep the boats out of this area here yeah because i'm not coming too close you see yeah hey nice being with all the way that yeah man you're welcome you're yes. welcome yes you know when i was going to rosary rosary boys rc right on park and charlotte street every friday evening daddy will pick me up and then we'll go to st Teresa gills all right, so big up the Rosary boys, big up the St. Teresa girls, and he and mommy will pick us up. And back then it was probably something like Chuck Wagon, mm -hmm. right? Wagon, yeah. Pass by a bucket of Chuck Wagon chicken, and we will come to Maracas Bay here. All right, not this particular area, but more down by the cliff area there. Let me see if I can zoom in. Right, is he down in the corner there? My Uncle Sam? Right, that is where we will pack up and feed. Daddy boy will really give us a lot of good memories, eh? Yeah, man. Thank yeah. you. You all have really done a good job as parents. Yeah. And you know what's the sad thing? How easy we could forget sometimes. We get taken up with our own lives and we forget. Yeah. Negative things start to come in the way and we forget even more. That's right. But today has triggered some really good memories in my mind. And I want to tell you, thank you so much for all that you all have done for us. You're welcome. You're welcome. Man. Lisa, Liba, Linda, and myself. Can't go wrong. <laughs> and now telling them about, you know, Lisa bring us after school here on a Friday to have a nice sea bath every friday evening and we used to stop by um it's chuck wagon i think it is yeah and also or golden skillet yes and also we used to stop by um linda's bakery was around all that time you know yes yes and yes buy this nice custard corn yes yes so, yeah, i think we used to pick up that on the way back yes yes, yes. yes. Maybe that's why I, I feel it from there. I love custard cones, you know. Yeah, but what you with that, red, that with that red cherry, some places you, you still get it. Yeah, you Let me go me come on the arm. Um, the umbrella here. Rain falling, people. Lancy here. Yeah, yeah. Louis, I, I go in here to get wet. You, you, <laughs> go on, you go on bed? All right, go, go, go. Yeah, she could still run, boy. <laughs> yeah? Nice, man. Yeah. 
So we lie, man. Yeah. Yeah, we lie, man. We lie, man. Yes. We have a good time. I'm happy to be with all the Sidonian and um, Gary. Gary. And same here. Yes, yes. Nice, quiet, positive vibes. Hey, Lancy? Positive vibes. Yeah, man. Positively so. You know, Sana? Yeah. The study we have for Bible study tomorrow. Act right. It's a continuation of Acts 27. Paul and them were taking a trip. And they were in this ship and they had shipwreck. And in, in, at the end of the 27th chapter, it describing to you all of the steps they had to take to make it through the storm, the shipwreck. And they made it onto land. And they were greeted by some very kind-hearted people. Hmm. The, the natives of the island, you know? And it starts out in the 28th chapter that they recognized where they were. They could describe and name the little island that they came on. But they ended up staying there three months, right? I think so. Yeah, they were on that little island for three months. And it was calm and comfort after a shipwreck. Hmm. And you see the spiritual lesson in that. Hmm. We don't have to fear going through the storm with God. He will always make the provision for calm and comfort mm. after so the while, shipwreck. So while they were they're stranded, they were actually finding peace. They were finding peace. So we always will find peace when we invoke the Spirit to come. When we invite Him and say, come Lord, come, come, stay with me. Hmm. We will always find calm and comfort. Never forget that. Really? Yes. Deep message. Always. I love that. He never let us down, you know. He never lets us down. A lot of people think, oh, he up there. But he down here, right here, right beside us. His spirit is moving among us and helping us. Hmm. And give us his, giving his angels charge over us. There's another portion of scripture that speaks about how each one of us have an angel. So we are all... We are all assigned an angel by God to watch over us. So we might feel like we are alone, but we are never alone. As long as we keep turning to the Spirit to invoke His presence and bring Him near to us, He will always be there for us. Really good. But one thing, you know, God never forced Himself on us. He waits for us to be the ones to call him. Hmm. I believe that. Yes. I definitely believe he that. He don't force himself on us. He knows he's there. And he knows what he's capable of doing for us and by us. But if we keep calling out after him, he'll carry us through every storm. Right. I like somebody shared a little thought with me. A few years back, I had lost my job. And I was feeling very down, you know. And... He said to me, he said, Sidani, God will take you to your limit, but he will never take you past it. Hmm. So he know how much you can bear, you know. Well, and he will, that, that, and he, is, and he will, that is a deep piece of talk there. And he will only give you what is enough for your strength yes. in the given experience. Hmm. So he will give you calm and quiet after that storm. Wow. Thanks for sharing that, Sidoni. Anytime, brother. Yes. Anytime. And you know, I have a question to ask you all. Yes. All right? Heavy question. Does God know our secret thoughts? He absolutely does. He does? Yes. All right. And the next question I have to ask. Does the devil also know our secret thoughts? I believe so. Some people would disagree with me. Mm -hmm. But I can always tell when the devil is recognizing a thought I have because of the pull and the push and the intensity to feed that thought. Yes. And he drives that through human nature. And you have to be the one to turn to him and tell him, I see what you're trying to do. 
Yes. But God is going to have victory. Hmm. And I'm going to exchange the thought, the negative thought you have, you are trying to infiltrate in me. I'm a, and I'm going to replace it by a thought that God wants me to entertain. I was thinking along the same lines. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> That question really came to me this morning, eh? I say, I wonder if the devil could read my thoughts. And what I think he could read is our negative thoughts. I don't think he could read our positive thoughts. He don't want you to. Right? Mm -hmm. So, even in our secret mind, we have to be careful about the things we're thinking about. Definitely, right? Because according to what she said, um, you could feel that when you have a negative thought going on, that Satan is trying to hold on to it and develop on it, Absolutely. right? So that is that is the same way I feel about it. That you gotta really be careful. According to what Melvin Tool said once, right? Um, you have to be careful with thoughts, and even while it's in an impulse, you need to get rid of it, mm -hmm. right? So don't even like turn to our thought people. Mm -hmm. Somebody share, also shared another thought that any thought we have that is negative, we can always rest assured that it is n it is never being given to us by the enemy, by the devil. But any thought that is good for us, it will always be a thought that will originate from God. Because God always wants the best for us. Hmm. He'll, he'll never keep us out of the hard experiences. Because hard experiences are supposed to build a better spiritual character in us. Right? And I venture to say, it should build a good earthly character in us too yes definitely right? but anytime we have thoughts that are not heavenward bound we know that they don't belong to heaven and it's the devil feeding that hmm. words of wisdom and where is Lulu the let me just go and check you there quick I got a little footage Sidoni thank yes. you so much for sharing because I was really thinking deeply upon that this morning. Anytime. So it's nice to hear somebody else's perspective. If we ever come back, we could hear what Gary had to say about that. Hmm. Yeah. So let me go and check out Lulu. See to get some footage. Alright. And you know the thought was occurring to me that all these different people you see along the beach all right you'd never could tell what each group is talking about who would i ever think that somebody might have been having a conversation like that on the beach so you see everybody in their own little world all right and respect respect Look at them skies now. Gosh. Lulu. And guys, I am nervous pulling this phone. It does not be like, hey, die, die, die. <laughs> She's like to show off her. <laughs> she see the camera, she make her belly flap. Mommy is having a ball of our time. I will tell you something. Many times you will be wondering, but how this person always so happy? How this person 
Looking like nothing go bother them. Guys, this is the answer right here. My mom and dad have been doing this for decades. For decades, people. Right? All in now start to see. But these are the kind of things that brings you happiness, people. What happened? Eh? Was she going too far? Hey, um, Bobby! Come on this way! She had dinner. <laughs> Come on this way, please! Spin camera. Flip camera. I flip camera slowly, gracefully. Are we going back out the tent? I know telling them, mommy, you, she good hard, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right, so I pass the camera to daddy. Oh no, man, just, just let it flow, now, man. Just let it flow. Uh -huh. Like, remember, you're holding the camera. Like I'm, I'm holding it this way, yeah? Yes. Yes. Just in process in life, yeah, huh? Work in progress. And, and the see, more you can extend out your hand is the better. Right. And you know they say right. you're never too old to learn. Never That's too right. old to learn. You know? Lyndon taught me well, you know? Yeah. Yeah. He taught you this? Yeah, this? well, he showed many little hand movements and ah, things. Okay, 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 okay. Sin? No, well, remember, if you want to get cool now, I'm gonna tell you. Using the back camera to Oh, so it. this is for distance? Well, Maybe. These are better quality. So if you want to get it to Sidoni, uh -huh. you could just gently turn it like that. Uh -huh. And now you could hold it like that if you want. Uh -huh, all right. Right. Fine? Okay. Okay. Sid, I'm yes. coming back at you again, girl. I'm so relaxed right Not now. Not too, too close. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I'm enjoying this. Very good. I'm glad to hear that. Okay, buddy. Yeah, man. Yes. Flip camera. Flip camera. <laughs> Flip camera, boy. I guess it's the wind, you know? Hey, look at that nice summer clothes, you boy. Where is that? Yeah. No, it's in the camera right now. Watch it. Nice, eh? Beautiful, yeah. This little part right here reminds me of Tobago. Um, Englishman's Bay. Oh yes, in this one's bay. A beautiful bay, eh? but they, they haven't done much with it. Yeah. It's deep, you know. Yeah? It's a deep bay, yeah. Lots of ships that they have been sunk there and oh. yeah. sunk there in years gone by. Lots of Englishmen probably lying at the bottom of the ocean there. Yeah. <laughs> look at that, look at that between here. <laughs> Okay, friend. Keep an eye on the flag. Keep an eye on that flag. Yeah, man. Well, well, well. If you give that little fella in front of you there a little back rub there, I can end this beautiful. Ah, oh, very good, this. It's very good. 